So I write a lot of songs. It's one of the things I do, and it's somewhere between a hobby and a career. I haven't made quite enough money at it to call it a career, but uh, enough that I keep going. Um, and we do what's called a co-write, which is where you get two or three people in the room to sort of create this song. And it's not that I am incapable of sitting in my room and writing a song. And some of my favorite songs are ones that are very personal that I wrote alone. Um, but over the last five years, and you know, about a thousand songs later, uh, I've had the opportunity to create art, create music with some people. And in that process, as I'm sharing my experience and my skill set as a writer, and they're sharing theirs, and then all of a sudden this piece of art that gets created that none of us could have created on our own, because it's a blend. Um, and one of the things that happens is that you've got two other people or another person challenging you and going, yeah, uh, I think you can say that better. Uh, I know you. I know you're a great lyricist. I think you can tweak that. Let's, let's work on it. Right? And so you have the sharpening process. And I think that that is a pretty good analogy for the real world. I, there's a lot I could do on my own. Um, but when you actually have somebody who gets to know you, that you open yourself up to, that you are vulnerable with, vulnerability births vulnerability, right? And so I, sometimes I talk to people who are really frustrated with community, and I get it. And not everybody can just go out and create it, and I understand that. Um, but in as wherever you're able to, you sort of create the community that you desire. So if you desire deep relationships, you have to sometimes push and be vulnerable. And, and it hurts and it sucks and it doesn't always work out and people don't always fall through and it's, it's messy. Relationships are messy. Humans are, are messy. Um, but as I do that and you actually get to know me and then you are in my life and you can go, man, I, uh, I think you could do this better. I think that you could create a better situation. You know, have you thought about this? You can challenge me, and I, I'm giving you that space because we've been building that bond. Um, and so I, I think that just community in general, uh, it, it's a great mirror to reflect and go, hey, is this who you want to be? Are you being who you've told me you want to be this person, this person, and this person, and this is what you're about? And it seems like based on what you're telling me, you're not being that person right now. And so you, it's just a great mirror, and it's not condemning, and it's not judgmental or, or shaming. It's it's open and free and loving, um, but it's challenging.